Hey everyone, Brian from Sui Generis Brewing here. It is May 3rd, 2023, and it's time for part five of the 50 meter beer project. You'll notice today we're not outside. Uh, normal Canadian spring has returned, so instead of it being t-shirt weather, it is cold, wet, and miserable outside. The good news there though is this is the kind of weather barley actually likes, uh, especially in the spring. Uh, and so even as cold as it's been, we've even had a touch of snow. This stuff's growing pretty good. I think everything that's come up uh, has come up and it looks like I had a pretty high germination rate. Uh, really no complaints there. The hops that I cut back in the previous episode are starting to grow quite well. Uh, you can see here I've got a number of strong shoots coming out of this plant. And so in a week or so I'll be running my lines so that I can start to train these uh, up to the top of the house. You'll see here uh, next to me as well are the cuttings from those hops that I took in the last video. They have done uh, extraordinarily well as cuttings. Uh, you can't even see the tops of them here. They are more than twice as tall as they were when I brought them in. I bring this up here. You can see we've had some really good root development, which means that these are ready to be put into soil, uh, which is what I'm going to do now. Now I have nine plants here. Uh, one did get injured when one of our growing lights fell on it, um, but I'm going to see if I can't get them all potted, a couple to each plant, uh, and in another week or so I'll hopefully be able to move these outside. I've got some rings outside next to my old hop plants for some of these, and the rest, assuming that they take, I may try to plant in the back, sort of as some stealth hops, uh, and so long as our goats don't get at them, uh, it might be a little bit extra harvest in the fall. So anyways, I'll get potting, and that's basically it for today's video. So here's one of the better ones. You can see how nice and big the roots are. So I'm going to plant this one on its own because I think this will be one that will go in the house. And just look at how big that's gotten over the past few weeks. Alright, first one planted. Obviously needs a bit of water. That soil is pretty dry, but uh, good start. So here's my other strong grower. So we're going to plant this one on its own as well. And then the other ones I'll get planted with friends. There we have it. Eight of the nine hot plants that I had cut uh, took some roots, and uh, so those are all planted here. Uh, this one didn't root much at all, uh, so I didn't bother planting that one. I have more than enough here. These are also all the bigger ones. This is one of the smaller ones. So a little bit of water, get them back under the grow lights, and they should be good for next week. 